Carrie, the most recent information, uh, firefighters tell us after three hours of searching, they have stopped searching for the body here at the confluence of the American and the Sacramento River. Take a look at some of the video we shot over those last three hours of this search. Friends of the swimmer and some people in a nearby boat saw him try to swim across the American River near the confluence. They saw his body go down. They did not see his body come up. Rescuers swam and dove this section of the river where they believe the body would most likely be. Using a special kind of sonar, they were able to see what looked like a body in the deepest part of the river. That's the area that's most challenging to dive because of the strong current, obviously, on the bottom. It's also very tricky because it's near the confluent, meaning it's turbulent. It took three hours for divers to fully search the bottom of the river where they believe that body was. They did not find it. We spoke with one beachgoer who watched as the boater tried to help at first. Uh, she saw somebody swimming across and, and she was trying to help them and I guess they didn't make it. And then there was that guy sitting up there on the bridge and she, I guess she was waving at him. And then next thing you know the helicopter came and then everybody showed up. So after three hours of searching, the search has been called off for that body. Firefighters say this is the fifth time in the past week and a half they have been called to this stretch of the river for a drowning call. Live along the Sacramento and American Rivers, I'm Richard Sharp, KCRA 3 News.